Oh, I can't. You want a tour of my house? There are leaks all over my house right now. Brand new house, by the way. And every time it rains, it leaks. Just like a teenage girl's vagina. <laughs> I can't believe I'm gonna say this. It leaks so much like a little girl's creases when she watches me. <laughs> like a little girl's creases when she's watching those strange little boys on Musical.ly. I can't believe I. Shout out to Popcorn Bully for this sweet fan art of the Dumpatron 6000 profile picture. Appreciate you. Today we're talking about the most disgusting YouTuber besides uh, line maker, Colleen. One second. Colleen Ballinger. 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 She got exposed for encouraging her young audience in a group chat to repeat after her and shoot tampons into their mouths. I'm not joking. I swear I'm not high. <laughs> and she also sent her underwear to a viewer who was a minor. She also used to be known as Miranda Sings. When I was in school, the little girls would have their little Miranda Sings lunchboxes and they would sing the songs and the whole time that could have been a part of her game. So why did Colleen do it? Why did Miranda Sings become the very thing that the YouTube God sought to destroy? YouTubers who go to their young audience and make them eat tampons and send them underwear. Why would she do that? Why? Well, because she thinks it's hot. <laughs> so yeah, it's obvious that Colleen has some sort of like tampon entering mouth, uh, fetishizing. You know, she, she really like gets off on it and she wants to see other people do the same thing. I mean... But yeah, it's quite obvious here that she has some sort of like sick, demented, twisted ideologies of what she wants to spend her private parts doing with children. And I think that it's bad. That's my take. And honestly, if I wanted to, I could probably turn this into like a 50 minute expose over every nook and crevice of Colleen and her life and what went wrong and what she did. But um, you guys can just check out the T channels for that. But in today's video, I really wanted to pinpoint the point of this YouTuber is sick, this YouTuber is twisted, demented, and uh, I, I think she deserves a career. <laughs> This video is sick. This person at this point right now in June 2023 is being exposed for everything in the book from abusing their dog to abusing their boyfriend to abusing their minors to abusing their grandmother. I mean, I didn't want to mention it on this video, but she even abused me in my butthole when I was 15. <laughs> All this time I thought I was a virgin. <laughs> I'm not a virgin anymore. There's a penis in me at all times. A tiny penis. <laughs> I just wanted a baby. I didn't want a boy. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? No one's gonna believe that I'm the next Virgin Mary if there's a penis in me. This video is sick. Now, I did mention earlier in the video that, hey, when I was a kid, Miranda Sings, uh, or Colleen, whatever you want to call her, she was super popular in my middle school, and tons of girls had, like, backpacks and lunchboxes, and they really loved her videos. They would quote her videos all the time. I wonder if any of those people were actually in the DMs of Colleen, sending them, uh, you know, fucking tampon-eating videos, sending them underwear. I mean, dude, you can only really think what really happens, right? John Swan is a lying, backstabbing piece of shit. But yeah, I don't really understand this whole Colleen situation. I mean, I understand that she's obviously, you know, like, you know, pedophilic tendencies, grooming tendencies, abusing animals tendencies. But my whole thought process here is like, why? Why is it that, you know, she wasn't even just on like an echelon of YouTube that's high. She was on the highest echelon of YouTube. Like I said, she had lunchboxes, backpacks, fucking sponsorships, millions of dollars in the bank. Where is she now? She's gonna be dead in two months. 